We're gonna hop into the game now. And we are now gonna start with the Trackmania World Tour map discovery. So, um, yeah, the Trackmania World Tour this year is of course a little bit confusing. I also think not many of you are following it because in general uh, it seems like not that many people are interested in it. But as a pro player, I still have to play it, of course. <laughs> and uh, yeah, we actually have Map Pack 2 being released now. Um, the way this works basically is that we're gonna have um, a new map pack consisting of five maps every two months. And we already had the spring map pack, which was used for the monthly cups in April and May. And now we basically have the summer map pack, which is uh, yeah gonna be used in the um, Nadeo tournament. So for example, the monthly cup, but also a few other ones in June and July. And the maps came out on Friday evening, I think. And because of the LAN tournament that I attended, I of course had no time to check them out yet. And because of that, we're now gonna do a small map discovery. Five maps on the line. We're gonna check them out. I haven't seen anything yet, so this is gonna be completely blind. We're gonna play like 10 minutes per map or so. And uh, yeah, let's see what Nadeo has cooked. I am interested. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I know the maps are not supposed to be super difficult. That's all I know. That's literally everything I know. So I would say, map one. Where is my open planet? Yeah, hello guys. Four open planet plugins. Yeah, fantastic. Yik. <laughs> yeah, am I downloading? Yeah. Okay, and I also don't have my metal window. There we go. Alright, so map 1 is called Agility Dash 2. That is already a very interesting name because Agility Dash, um, maybe that might ring a bell for some of you because that was a map from Trickmania World Tour Stage 1 in 2023, so from a year ago. And uh, yeah, we now have a version number 2 apparently. Version number 1, I can tell you, was like 1 minute 20 or 1 minute 30 long and was really, really difficult. It was a very interesting map. So let's see if this one is even remotely uh, similar to that. We're going in. Let's see what we uh, have here. What has Nadeo cooked? Of course, uh, Agility-1 had an identity, which was uh, mostly about using like small plastic tiles, the ones that you also just saw at the beginning. I guess we're gonna, yeah, these ones here. I guess we're gonna see them being used over the whole course of the map, I guess. I guess that's like the, the theme of the map, you could say. I mean, we don't have identities anymore, but the maps Wait, why does the grass look so weird? Wait, why that grass looks cursed? It's like a normal grass block, but it has the texture. Also, this is very easy so far. Holy shit. There's like nothing you have to do here. Except for steering. Ah, but yeah. It's, it's like normal grass blocks, but it has the textures from the stadium grass. Interesting. Oh, we have a castle. Okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hello, guys. My name is Bounce. Alright, alright, alright. Ping, ping, ping. Ooh. Okay, this is a. Uh, this, this is or this is like a quasillion million billion times easier than Agility Dash One. Dude, this is like such a piss easy map. What is this? Holy moly! I mean, this is gonna be smooth to watch, I guess. But this is gonna be boring to play. I can already tell you that. There's like no this, this feels like a cup of the day grass map. Like you don't do anything besides steering, and maybe like one slide or so. Uh, I don't really understand why the uh, world tour maps are so easy. Because no, not a single beginner is playing Trackmania World Tour. I know it's an open circuit and theoretically anyone can play it. But in reality, barely anyone is playing it at all. And the only players who are playing Trackmania World Tour this year are also like, you know, like semi-pros at least. So I know there's like no reason to make the map super easy. I actually also know why the maps are easy, <laughs> because uh, we spoke a little bit about it at Comic Con. But uh, yeah, it's kind of—I mean, I don't know if it's like confidential info or not, but I'm just not gonna say why or like who's the reason for that. <laughs> but yeah, maps are actually like this first one here is super simple. This is gonna be one of these type of maps where when you lose point one against the best players in the world, you cannot come back anymore. That's crazy, actually. Okay, I mean, the map is smooth. I gotta give that. Seems smooth. Nothing... Nothing feels, like, really weird or unflowy or anything. But... I don't know. Seems very, very simple. Too sim way, too si way too simple for my taste, to be honest. Could literally be a cup of the day map. Naya, Trackmania World Tour this year. We all know it. Yeah, 
is interesting. Also, what are we listening to here right now? Resident Sleeper map for viewers? I mean, yeah, yeah, I don't know, like the map itself, yeah, it's at least gonna have good races, I guess. But that's it. This looks like last year's CCB maps, yeah. Yeah, it it's like super easy, like holy moly. Also, hello Cam, Winke. Cam, how was the how was the last evening yesterday? I heard it was fun from Massa. <laughs> I'm very sad I couldn't join. Yeah, like the thing is, like this is one of these maps. Massa and me will have practice maps. We're gonna play the practice maps each for ten minutes, and then I can drive point two close to world record here. No problem. Like, no part where you can really gain time or something. Okay, I don't know if you wanna lose that gear here or not. Okay, this is a no slide. Holy moly, this is like so... This is like the easiest map I've ever seen in the entirety of World Tour. This is also way easier than the five maps we had in the first one. The first map pack. I would say. It is a very smooth map though. But yeah, very simple. Very, very simple. It's all the drifts, yeah, probably. Like, it's gonna be the two, three drifts that you have here. And then the rest is just steer, steer, steer. Fantastic. You can literally be competitive on this map with Donkey Kong bongos, because you will not need more than... Yeah, you barely even need four button, four input buttons to play this map. You just need break. Uh, you just need to accelerate all the time because everything is going to be full speed here. Then you steer left and right, and then you hold break maybe once or twice on the map. Yeah, hello. Ay ay ay. The thing is on maps like this also is like if uh, let's say I uh, take the monthly cup giga series and I want to go for the win. Um. Like, maps like this, literally anyone can drive. Like, literally every somewhat good Trackmania player and their mama can play these maps, like, really nicely. So if you are, like, a really good player, you will not have a big of an advantage over a normal good player. I don't know if that makes sense for you guys. But on more difficult maps, the skill gap is just bigger, you know? So it's less random who wins there. Like on a difficult set or team map or old team GL map, a very, very, like a Carl Jr. will never lose against someone who's like only good, you know? But on maps like this, it could happen. In some rounds at least. And then with finalist mode and stuff, holy moly, eh. And this is gonna be crazy close. It does make sense? Okay, yeah, it's hard to, hard to put it into words. Yeah, like I feel like my discovery on this one is finished. I mean, of course, I'm still quite far away from AT. But... Hmm. I mean, it's a bit tricky with the gears, at least. Mada and Granadi type map? Uh, I don't know. Not really. Not really, to be honest. And yo, Squeal, hello. And thank you. I'm not good on maps like this. Like, I'm definitely better on... Like, the more difficult the map is, the better I am. Because my... The thing is, in, in, in match, you will be... You will have to drive close... You will basically have to drive world record pace on these maps. To win rounds later on, you know? And on more difficult maps, it's uh, consistency that matters more. And as you guys probably all know, I am more of a consistency player than a pace player. So, maps like this are not really helping me. <laughs> maps like this are maybe good for people like Stufts, you know? Who can just like full YOLO on world record and here they will probably not crash. Or like Epos, you know? Naya, okay, okay, okay. I would say we're gonna bring through one more run here. Okay, you have to lose the gear here, there's no way you keep that. And here you just go inside to grip early. Then a slide, but also a very simple one, like... Not even I struggle with that. <laughs> I'm really not a tech abuser, then you hold left for 10 seconds. Into holding right. For 10 seconds. Into holding left, losing the gear. I like that you at least have some gear changes. Imagine you would drive the entire map in gear 4. I would literally fall asleep during a match. 
Yeah, then another drift, which is even easier than the first one. Holy moly, like this is way too easy. This is way too easy. There is like nothing happening here. Holy moly, my girlfriend could drive the matches for me and wouldn't have the same result. And this is uh, way too easy. Way too, like map is smooth, but it's literally a cup of the day map. I like for, for like map itself is good, but in the context of Trackmania World Tour, it's a bad map, to be honest. It's just too easy, in my, uh, at least in my opinion. <laughs> map is good, but for what it's supposed to be, it's too easy. Anyway, next map. Maybe that was only... If, I mean, if only that map is like simple and the rest is like more difficult, then okay, I guess. Then, you know, have some variety, it's fine. Well, we will see that. Next map is called Kenyan by SRK. Yeah, hello guys. Okay, it looks very flat. It looks like a very... Why is this map called Kenyan? Where's that name coming from? I neither see a Kenyan, nor do I see a Kenyan car. Why is it called Kenyan? Okay, maybe I will notice something uh, while driving. We'll see. Ooh. Okay. Hop, hop. Ooh, okay, that's tight. Okay, I like that. Okay, this map is already more difficult now, until here, than the entirety of the first map. Honestly, giving the previous map the name Agility Dash, which was one of the most complicated maps of that season, is kind of a kind of a fraud. That feels wrong. Okay, this is better. Yeah, this is better. This is better. This is more difficult. More technical. Which is also not necessarily better for me. But this is just better in general. Yeah, okay, 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 okay. Very technical and slow map. I see, I see, I see. Ooh, okay. Okay. Oh, dirt uphill, ain't no way. Ah, yeah, yeah. My favorite block in Trackmania. I'm really sure I'm not supposed to be in third gear all the time. Yeah, hello guys, it's the jump. Yeah, what is this? Yeah, hello! Yeah, where's the... Yik. Okay. Once you have no speed here, you are giga slow, apparently. That is fantastic. Finish? Yeah, hello guys, it's the hole! Yik. Okay, 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 okay. Way more technical. I have no clue why it's called Kenyan. But okay. The map itself seems way better. Not my type of map as well, I can already tell you that. This is like pure driving. But just in itself, it's way better. Than map 1. Because it's more difficult. And competitive maps in the highest competi competitive league kind of. Just has to be difficult. Like, it cannot be piss easy come off the day maps. Nobody wants to play that on the highest level. This could be an outside uh, turn, actually. This here feels a bit unsmooth, but I guess it's fine because of plastic. Well, this is gonna be tricky with the gears. Because I guess you can stay in. Uh, you can stay in. 4th gear most of the time, but you need like really good lines to keep them, you know, or to keep it. Oh, shit. Okay, never mind. There's no way you keep 3rd gear through this. This feels like a Comic-Con Baltics map, to be honest. Like the Comic-Con maps, for some reason, had a lot of left-right slalom things, where you go from a full steer left to a full steer right, but at like very close timings, you know. And this kind of feels the same. Okay, this is 4th gear, and then you will also, yeah, you want to keep 4th gear through this here. Very classic turn in Trickmania. Also holding 4th gear here, we have a jump, okay, probably the first one of the entire map pack. Okay, yeah, it's still, I would still say it's a bit too easy, but this is better. This is better, this is good. I like that. I don't know who, I don't know who built the maps, by the way, no clue. But, uh, this seems better. This seems better overall. Airtime spotted? Yeah. Alarm, alarm, alarm. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Can you keep four here? Nah. Then you go here, then you go here. Can you go inside? Ping, ping. 
I mean, there's also, like, nothing happening here. Like, there won't be any spot where you can really gain time. When you lose something, you just lose. But it's at least more difficult, you know? It's like the same type of map as the previous one, just more difficult. That is my uh, summary. Very flowy as well. Very easy to drive this good, to be honest. Because it, everything makes like sense on this map, you know? Like, I already get like somewhat clean runs through. And I, ba I barely just saw it, you know? Hey, yo, Shengar! Jan, you're welcome, my friend! It was nice to meet you, Shengar. <laughs> Always happy to sign your wheel. Yeah, of course, at the Comic Con, guys, uh, we also met a lot. Like, I met a lot of people that I haven't met before. One of them was Shengar. Also, people like Siren, for example. Siren was very happy to meet me. Also, a bunch of other Trick Mania players, of course. It was a really fun weekend. I can also tell you guys, um, regarding Comic Con, um, we had one of our big media guys with us. And uh, we decided to record a very fantastic and entertaining vlog for you guys, which will be uploaded on the Big Clan YouTube channel. Probably. Yeah, like. Tomorrow, I guess? Tomorrow? Or, or in two days at latest. So we finally cooked the vlog again. A very fantastic one. We're gonna watch it on stream as well once it releases. And uh, yeah, would be of course much appreciated if you guys would support that because uh, yeah, I think it's always cool for it's always cool for us having the um, tournaments documented. And I think it's also cool for, for you guys to like see what's going on behind the scenes and what we're gonna do each day and stuff. So yeah, gonna be nice. You can already look forward to that. Okay, let's focus. I want to get a clean run through. Very easy to drop the gear here, actually. It doesn't lose that much time, I guess. But uh, you don't want to do that. Yeah, here you have to drop it. Not sure if it's fast to go outside or not. There's nothing to find out for now. Okay, that was actually quite easy with the gear. Here you lose it again for sure. Then you go here, ping, 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 left, right, left, right. Your mama is a left, right. Fuck. <laughs> we go again. Dun, 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 dun. Well, this is kind of, the start is kind of tight, not gonna lie. Wait, you guys saw my beautiful face on Reddit. Wait, what? What happened there? Yeah, mashallah, there's the gear. Then we go like this, then you go like this. I don't know if you can drive this outside, to be honest. Ah, yeah, you can. Okay, okay. You can, you can, of course. Yeah, also this map, as I said, you can, you can already mark it down. Or like, you can already... Um, wait, how do you say that? Mark my words? No. Wait, is that how you say it? Mark my word? Mark my word? Is that correct? Anyway, uh, but in the matches, in the monthly cups, um, the races here will be insanely close. And people will drive uh, close to world record here. Ah, mark it. Okay, it was correct. Alright. I was a bit confused. But also remember guys, I'm already awake for quite long. I had an exhausting day. My brain is a little bit XD already. Ah, I had to release. I mean, I, maybe I didn't have to, but I decided to do so either way. Small pussy release. Ah, okay. So then we go zack, then we go zack, 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 break, 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 slide, slide, slide. Now soup it around the outside here, zack. Now important to get a good entry here to keep that fourth gear up the hill. Then we go peng. Then we initiate another slide, keep the gear here hopefully, yes. Then we go like this, zack. Then smooth into this, a little bit to the outside to get a better angle. And then we just go like this, like this, like this, and suck. That was kind of clean. Okay, nice. Alright, yeah, uh, cool map. This one, I like it more than the previous one. I don't know if I will be better on this one or on the previous one. Because this one is very technical, and on technical maps I always struggle a little bit. But, um, yeah, fun map. Fun map. But still, nothing, nothing, nothing special, to be honest. Next up, high note. Okay, what do we have here? 
Looks interesting. Already looks a bit more dank. I see. What's this here? Okay, this already looks more dank. High note. Yeah, thank you very much for Rocky Luffy for the ad. Thank you very much for the two month freestyle as well, of course. Yeah, good focus. Yeah, I could actually drink a Red Bull, but I think I'm not gonna. I think I'm just gonna stick with my Volvic water today. But this looks very dank. Okay, this this could be, this could be, this could be something special at least. Wait, Sovi Marcos, 41 month free sub, one minute ago. Thank you very much, Marcos. I I totally skipped it. Thank you very much, Marcos. I appreciate it. <laughs> Any 360s in the new maps? Uh, so far, no. Yeah, hello, guys. Okay. Ooh. Oh, hello, guys. We have jumps. Interesting. Haven't seen that in a while. Haven't seen that in a while. This is a weird jump. Oh. Okay, this is already the way more dank. What is this? Yeah, hello guys, we have a jump. We have many jumps. Yeah, okay. So bleiben ruhig. Now the map pack gets interesting. Okay. Yeah, hello guys! Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, already best map, I can already tell you, because this is something... This is... This has like... This map has a character. A character other than I am a cup of the day map. Yeah, okay. Gefährlich, gefährlich, gefährlich. Ooh. Okay, okay. Yeah, this is dank. Yeah, finally, something good, man. Ooh. Okay, this is gonna take a bit longer to learn. <laughs> But I also wanna need time to learn these maps. It's uh, like. It's not cup of the day, man. After 15 minutes, I don't wanna be like max on the maps already. That's boring. Ah, du Kage. Ugh. Ah! Yeah, I do not have the speed for that. Yeah, okay. Sending respawn. Okay, very small quarter pipe. And we go here. Yeah, we have. Yeah. Oh, risky finish. Okay, that's a cool map. Plus, plus. Best map so far. This is a banger. An absolute banger. As long as all of these XCD things are consistent. Okay, how do I make this jump? It's a banger. The risky is really cool. Yeah, true. Okay, this is gonna be hard. This is going to be hard to drive fast. That might end up being the most important part of the map. Okay, so what do I have to do here? I mean, it somewhat works, but I don't think I'm doing it correctly. But okay, I'm surviving. That's fine. And here between the flags, then we have like... Ay -ay 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 -ay. Okay. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah. Ay, 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 ay. Oh, what was the risky again? Ah, yeah. Jump down. Yeah, hello guys, my name is Kanagi and I'm not going to make the risky. Okay, 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 okay. This is uh, interesting. Hard maps are the best to watch players on. Yeah, true. I agree. Easy maps are not for the... Highest skilled players in the game. Is the risky? Uh, we'll see. If I maybe I will get an attempt at the risky finish where I have somewhat good speed. So far, every single attempt was absolutely yak there. So. Yeah, that is a no slide and a half. I can already tell you. Oh. Okay, that looks like an interesting trickster. Okay, that's a really bad line again. Here you wanna keep as much speed as possible. Yeah, look at this, plus 16. Absolutely Joe when you have like low speed there. And then like this. Yeah, this, uh, this map has a good vibe. This is nice. This is a good one. The first map that really suits the purpose in my opinion. Holy, okay, you need a lot of speed. Okay, 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 never mind. Never mind, that is actually crazy. 
And yeah, true, we have new blocks at the store. That's interesting. I don't know if the, the mappers of these maps had access to the new blocks before the desert update already. But these blocks here are literally not even out for a week. And the maps are using them. I don't know if whoever built this. Is it Banano? Probably it's Banano. If he cooked the maps within like a few days only. But okay, you gotta watch out for the gear change there. Then like this and then like... Is that good speed? I have no idea. Plus seven. Yeah, hello guys. Okay, so how do we get more speed for the ending? Okay, placing freewheel to avoid gear issues. Smart. So what if I go really late and go for like literally maximum speed? Yeah, okay, okay, so you can go wide to get like more speed and then you will make it. Alright, alright, alright. Ha, huh, okay. Can these maps contain custom blocks? Uh, I have no idea what the exact mapping rules are to be honest. And I also don't really remember if we had that already. Um, no clue. Honestly, no clue. Wait, these are not new? Are they not? Aren't these the new blocks or am I stupid? Yeah, whatever. I don't know. I don't know. I also like the scenery with these like three block roads here. This looks cool. Would have been funny if these kind of things would have been used somehow with like a reactor down or something. That would have been cool. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go a little bit further here, guys. Wow, making this jump like like close with the landing is going to be super important. This is probably going to be the most important part of the map, I can already tell you. Probably going to be really important. If you over jump there, you will lose so much speed and time, it's crazy. But this will be a Kanali part, trust. Uh, yeah, this is for sure a no slide. In third gear, that is a drift cancel and a half. I still don't know what to do here, though. I get like some weird bounces there sometimes. But now I have plus 33 speed. That's of course quite a lot, you know. And here you want to land flat and get like maximum exit speed. There you can perhaps even touch the water. And go a little bit more inside because of it. Because the water, the tires will dry either way. Yeah, this here is a bit bumpy. I don't know what to do there yet. And here probably like release to like land early you know and yeah if you go like this it's easy but this is not the never mind it's not easy yeah hello guys my name is Kanali yeah okay wait stop halt stop it's not easy ah because I'm landing like giga tilted yeah okay stop 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 yeah yeah we're blam -wish, we're blam -wish. yeah look if I land flat then it's easy yeah okay then it's easy Ha, okay, okay, okay. I mean, you already see it on this map. Um, the gaps in the top five are also a lot bigger. Like 0.4. Way bigger than on the previous maps. On the previous maps, people already were maxed, I feel like. Of course they are not, but like, you know, it, it felt like it. Mashallah, the nose light. Ah, that was not so great, I think. Oh, there's the pool border. Yeah, yeah. Your mama has a pool border. Okay, you wanna, don't want to hit the pool border, that's for sure. Okay, come on, make it. And hop. Yeah, easy, easy, easy. And insta air break as well. Zack, 55.1. Okay. Okay, not bad. Less than a second behind world record. That is pretty solid for a difficult map like this. Yeah, alright. Map number three, high note. Definitely my favorite so far. This map has like some identity, has some character, has some parts where you can also gain some time. Um, this is how the map should be, to be honest. Really good. Transitions seem terrible in this map. Nothing lines up. Uh, I wouldn't say so. Most things felt pretty nice, to be honest. And with practice, it's gonna be fine. Okay, next up, we have Oasis. Oasis. Yeah, looks rather simple. 
I don't know, I see plastic, I see... I see a looping, yeah, I see plastic, uh, looks like plastic and tech. Naja, okay, we're going in. At least it's using the new blocks, that's cool. I haven't seen the new blocks on the stadium map yet. That is nice. Oh shit. Yeah, hello guys, that is not an outside sled. Oh, this will, okay, this could, this will be a clean map, I think. But the thing is, this one at least has some tech and stuff. Like, this will be better than agility dash map, I think. Oh, shit. Yeah, okay. Yeah, hello, guys. I cannot make it. Yuck. Hmm. All right, all right, all right. The thing is, in Drift, you can... Like, I'm not the greatest tech abuser in this nation, but on Drift, you can at least gain some time, you know? Yuck. Tunnel scenery blocks. Is this a Spammy J map? I don't think Spammy J would ever map for an ADO competition. <laughs> It'd be funny though. I mean, I would rather want to play most of the Spammy of the day maps in competitive than the current kind of world tour maps we have. Because the Spammy J maps are at least interesting. Okay. Oh shit, yeah. Okay, clean, clean, clean. Tap, 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 tap. Yeah, hello guys. Wait, was there wood? Ah, Inshallah, good map. Finally, some wood. Okay, good one. Plus, plus. Where do we go? Here. Okay, 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 that looks interesting. What in the galaxy loop is this? Oh, that's cool. Okay, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. That is something new. That is something I haven't seen before. Yeah, okay. Gefährlich. That looks very nice. Felt weird, but felt cool. Oh, more wood? Yeah, mas mashallah. Good map. Wait, how do we jump here? Oh, ain't no way. Can we jump like this? Ach, du Kacke. Okay, that's kind of insane. We jump like here, and then you can stick the landing. Like you can safe jump, you can jump like this, I guess. And then finish. But you can also just go like here, and then go here, and then like, you know, like nail the landing, and then you have more speed. Like this. Okay, plus plus, good map, good map, good map. It seemed a bit boring at the beginning, but with these kind of loopings and uh, the ending, I like that. This is good. This is a good one, guys. This is a good one. Seems like a Massa map pick, to be honest. Like on this map and on the first two maps, Massa will be really good. And Massa told me that he wants to go very try hard for this map pack. For the monthly cups and for the other tournaments hosted with this with these maps. He said he wants to go like full no life. So if he does that, then Massa is gonna be uh, super good. Trust. Yeah, hello guys, my name is Granadi. Geredet wird viel, yeah, we'll see. How was the LAN? Uh, pretty good, was fun. Result wise, was honestly as expected, but could have done in the ending also been better. So result wise, nothing crazy. But. Uh, yeah, overall, very fun tournament. And I was very pleasantly surprised by the city of Vilnius. I don't know what I expected. I didn't really have any expectations. But it turned out to be a really fun and cool city. Not gonna lie. Skip. Guys, what is, what is, what was the music? I crashed because we had uns, uns, uns music on stream, guys. I gotta say, the first map pack was felt a bit more uh, crazy. This feels a bit more down to earth again. I don't know if I like that. Also, I don't know if I like it, if I will miss the entry of the turn one more time, because I'm doing the exact same wrong line for the fifth time in a row there now. 
Good. You got Overseer. Yeah, hello guys! You have air time then? Yeah, that's 10 out of 10. Ah, du Kacke. Okay, now we come to the XCD looping. Oh my god, you have to go so far left already. Damn, what is this, man? This feels so weird. Plus, plus. And then also smooth into here. Yeah, that's a good one. Whoever built this, well played. Or well built. <laughs> Some nice cooking has been done on this uh, map here. I would have wished for more crazy parts like this. But of this, I'm happy. Okay, getting a clean run through will be hard here, to be honest. Not gonna lie, it's gonna be crazy. We have even more resubs. What is happening here? We have Pamika with the 39 month resub. Pamika, thank you very much. Good focus. Thank you. Then we have Chemno Death with the 7 month resub saying hello. Hello. And we also have Epiphany with the 37 month resub. Thank you. Thank you very much. Is this map 1? No, this is already map 4 actually. After this, there's only uh, one more map left. Yeah, hello guys, my name is Looping. Watch it later on YouTube? Yeah, I will definitely upload this to YouTube, of course. Don't worry, guys. Probably even as a main channel video. Probably even uncut. I don't think there's much that you, that's worth to edit here. So I will just save the money on the editor cost and uh, just upload it uncut. <laughs> okay, wait, I saw we got gift subs, but let me focus real quick because we are in a clean run, sort of. I think it was Katumi with five, yeah, okay, now I crashed it away. Katumi with five gift subs! Katumi, thank you very much, my friend. Holy shit, 25 now in total. Good focus, thank you. Going to OG Grimer, Eriso. Fan the Duck, the Dark Llama, and the Mad Nox. Wow. Thank you. Yeah, the latest uh, main channel uploads here are actually uh, pretty good. They're actually pretty, pretty good. Videos are doing nicely, so thank you for the support, guys. Much appreciated, because the main channel has been uh, slacking a little bit the past time. But lately, it's been cooking again. With more frequent video uploads, and also some more interesting, like, topics and stuff, or like content, you know, pretty nice. Therefore, the Grana TV uh, channel kinda got mudded because of all of the deep dip uploads. I don't know if you guys have seen that, but uh, yeah, my, my second YouTube channel kinda died because of that a little bit. So I will probably stop uploading the entire deep dip BODs there. And instead, I will probably only upload deep dip content about new PBs anymore. So whenever I do a PB run in the next future, I will always upload that run and not more. Because otherwise, uh, yeah, I feel like my second channel is doomed. Because barely anyone is watching like old, or, like, you know, like multiple days old deep to view these. I mean, why would you? Okay, I survived the run. But damn, this is crazy. Eh? This is hard. We have Furoku di Luffy now with a gift sub going to Lars. Yeah, thank you very much. Good focus. Yeah, Lars guy, eh. Uh, did I try Wizzy's wheel? Uh, I no, not at this event, but I already tried it at the uh, World Cup last year. I already met Wizzy for the third time now, so it was not new to me. So yes, I did, but not at this event. Okay, come on, one clean run, because the previous one was not like clean, clean. kind of line to be honest. It is kind of scary to be honest. I'm pretty sure I'm not supposed to lose my fourth gear there if you drive it nicely. But okay. And I'm also pretty sure this is not the correct line here. Did I have minus 20 speed? Please make this jump. Yeah, okay. Okay, 106.1. Alright, I think we can live with that. 
Damn, this is a difficult map. This is a really good one as well. I re like the, the previous one and this one are my two favorites so far. This is really fun to drive. Like it has a nice mixture of like normal driving and um, some crazy stuff, you know? That's pretty cool. I like it. I like it, I like it. The, check the checkpoint Apex was good? Yeah, here, right? Here I was like insanely close on a CP. Let's actually rewatch that because it was like very ubu. Where was that? Oh, here. Ah, now you didn't see it because of my camera! Man! Okay, wait, stop. Watching. Mashallah. Okay. <laughs> Alright. One more map, guys. One more map to discover. What do we have? Is it gonna be a good one or not? Ach du Kacke. It is called Wet Plastic. So I guess we're gonna have wet tires. We're gonna have plastic. And then also tech. You know, plastic. That could be that could be bad to be honest. <laughs> Especially like we already already the previous map had so much plastic. Why do we have another like why do we have two like plastic maps? Like plastic tech maps. That's weird. And we have a raid by Ender TM. Thank you very much, Ender, for the raid. Hello everyone. I'm currently doing my map discovery of the new Trickmania uh, World Tour maps. I uh, already checked out the first four maps. We're now on the final one, wet plastic. And uh, yeah, let's see what we have here. I am a bit scared to be honest. Because wet tires in general already always a bad sign. Like wet tires either are like okay or they are bad, you know, but they're never like great in my opinion. <laughs> so I'm scared. But okay. Okay, what in the pool is this? Is this a okay that's a no slide I think? Do we have wet tires soon? No. Okay. A wet tire no slide. Yeah, no slide is good. No slide, always good. Ah! Okay, I'm pretty sure I'm not supposed to bounce there. Probably go like this, and then you go like this. Yeah, nee, nee, nee. Not exactly like that. I guess I have to go for some more air tender. Ah, now you have like a wet tire drift. Okay, that felt kind of ooh. That felt kind of nice. Because you drift, of course, a little bit more with the wet tires. That felt nice. Could be good. I'm not so sure what this is about here. Okay. Drift to the right here, I assume. Yeah. Okay, flowy, flowy. Ooh! Okay, that was a tight drift. Surprised I didn't die there. Yeah, hello guys. Okay, this is a very blind map to be honest. We don't see shit here. But okay. Yeah. The maps are very technical in general. Very tech heavy. Oh shit. Yeah, okay, I didn't have the line for that. Ugh, okay. Hmm, better than expected I would say. When I saw the name I was scared. It's better than expected. But is it great? Huh? I don't know. I would also say this one is too simple. Too simple of a map, guys. Too simple. Oh my god, you can slide there. Close up smile? Yeah, I'm gonna do it after the map discovery. Chill your, uh, chill your nuts, guys. I saw it, don't worry. I do have a little bit of wet tires for this slide, so... Okay. Oh, that's literally the point of the map. Wet tires and slides. And there's only really one part of that. Or you could do like one consecutive slide here. I guess that's like intended. You do like one long slide. You jump into a slide and then you just stay in the slide. Stay in the slide, stay in the slide, stay in the slide until you're around the turn. Okay. Yeah, it kind of is like pool, but it definitely has some pool vibes. Ah, uh, yeah, no speed up the hill. That's fantastic. Okay. Yeah, cool idea to be honest. Too simple though. Once again, too simple. Not gonna lie. YouTube wants to see the close-up as well. Yeah, okay, man.
There you go. Hope you guys are happy. If you're happy in the YouTube comments, write XDD into the comments now. And we have 10 gift subs by El Diablo. Boah. El Diablo. Holy shit. Thank you very much for the 10 gift subs. How many do we have? 1093 gift subs in total now. Yeah, hello. That's a very uh, insane number. Thank you very much, El Diablo, as always. I appreciate it, of course. Uh, this time going to Carbon Raised Rainform, Doc D, Salachi, Nachtjäger, uh, Silas, Crispy Bacons, Mulma Pony, Eton Shirt, Septic Hamster, and Inyo. Yeah, El Diablo, thank you very much, man. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, before we go into, before we uh, stretch the YouTube discovery too long, let's quickly finish this map here. <laughs> Otherwise, YouTube people are going to complain again. So let's quickly uh, get a clean run for here. Because there's not too much to discover on this map, to be honest. Like, I'm pretty sure I already figured out, like, good lines and... Yeah, I don't know. Nothing crazy, you know? But here, I think we just go into a slide and then you just hold the steering. Maybe a little bit of adjusting with the steering and the braking, but that's literally the thing. YouTube people won't complain, they had a smile. Yeah, okay. We'll see about that. If I see a single person complaining in the YouTube comments, I'm gonna snap. And I'm gonna snap at Marcus. Kenyan type drift. Yeah, kinda, yes. Actually, yeah. Like a very long and slippery slide. I'm not sure if this turn is full speed, by the way. It could be, barely, but I think it's like maybe one nano release, but not more than that. Only a nano one. And then hop. This is not easy to control, to be honest. It's super weird, but could be really nice to drive. Then ping, ping. Oh, we can, oh my god, you can grip the inside there a little bit. Uh, actually, I don't know if you can, because then you have a very bad line, and you're gonna clip this edge here quite easily. So probably not. We're yeah, very tech-heavy map. Very tech-heavy. Oh my god, can I like for once not jump there? <laughs> ah, I didn't see that. Yeah, hello guys. My my name is uh, Wet Plastic, and I'm totally blind. That's actually a very blind map. Holy moly. Eh? So many things you do not see. Crazy. Ah, this is not a clean run though. Like, this is... Uh, nee. Like, we have to... We have to get a clean run. When Deep Dip 2? After this map? Yeah, okay. Nah, nah, nah. This is not full speed. There's no way you can drive to full speed. Ah, maybe? But I don't know. Like... Most of the time it will not be. That will be too difficult. Let's try again, like, if I know slide here. Yeah, okay, maybe not one consecutive slide. Hard to tell, to be honest. You can do one consecutive slide, but you can also just, um... Start it manually a little bit later. Might be faster. Shit, bad turn. Get this small pre slide now. That's very hard to keep grip there. It's super weirdly built, to be honest. You have to go for like a kind of weird line to not fly out there. Alright, please don't miss the finish, Granadi. There you go. 105.1. Yeah, I think we can take that. It's not AT. AT is already uh, is another half a second ahead. But I think we can take that as a, as a clean run. Okay, hmm. All right, yeah, cool map. Um, a bit too easy, I like the concept, but I mean, you know the map is called Wet Plastic and there's like one wet tire slide. Like there's literally only this one. This one here in the start, like this is a low slide. This one is not really wet tires. So it's a bit weird, but okay, I guess it's fine. All right, what do we think about the map pack as a, as a whole? Maybe as a small uh, verdict. Um. Overall, definitely too easy and too uncreative, in my opinion. Um, the only two maps that I would really consider creative are High Note and Oasis. I mean, maybe Wet Plastic a little bit, but uh, yeah. Agility Dash is the worst map, in my opinion, because it's literally Cup of the Day map, and I don't want to see maps like this in the highest level competition. It's just not fitting, you know? Just doesn't make sense to me. Um, Canyon is a bit better, a bit more difficult, but also still, you know, like just a normal map, nothing crazy. 
Uh, so, yeah, it's okay, but... Yeah, I, I might also be a bit special there. Like, it's a good map in theory, but it's just not, like, appealing to me. Then High Note, probably my favorite, because very creative. Oasis, as I said, pretty nice mixture between normal driving and, like, some creative parts as well. But this one is a good example of how, you know, how Agility Dash, in my opinion, should have looked like. And then the Wet Plastic map, also kind of cool, but also, I don't know, like, it's hard to tell, but, like, something is missing to me on that map. So overall, I would say an okay map pack. Um, I don't know if I like it more than the first one. I think the first one was actually more difficult and cre more creative. Like, you know, like the maps were all like different, very, very different. And here it feels like we have like kind of the same map all the time. So I don't know. I will, of course, uh, practice these maps a little bit more together with Master Guy for the next monthly cups. And uh, yeah, we will see. Maybe I will change my opinion, but so far I would say it's okay, but nothing crazy. Would have expected a bit more, to be honest. And uh, yeah, for these two people watching, I really hope you enjoyed the discovery, of course. Let me know down in the comments below what you think about the map pack, especially out of a viewer perspective, of course. And uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed and tschüssi, bye.